Hi everybody, Melody here. So, this is my third attempt, and this is my longer wig. I know I showed you a little bit. Um, I tried to actually brush it a little bit, so I know it's still messy, but I feel like this is probably my best look so far, because I finally shaved my chest, so if you can see some pricklies, I apologize, but I finally shaved my chest, and a lot of people were saying, stop covering your eyebrows, use your real ones. So, I did, but I put some glitter over top of them to kind of bring out the more feminine look into it, and I kind of really, really like this outfit, because I feel like almost like women empowerment in a way. I have boobies today. They're just socks, but don't tell anybody. Anyway, um, I am actually in a gown that I got from the thrift store for $5. If you can believe that, I was so, so happy. So I'm gonna try and stand up and show you the outfit. And I didn't do anything else to it. And this jacket part actually comes off. I love it because it's got beautiful like sequins on it. Really pretty copper color. So let me just think of the dress. Let me go ahead and show you. You like it? At all a little bit? And then look, see this part actually comes off. So you can wear it as just like a cocktail dress. See? But I actually kind of like the sleeves on. I thought it was going to make me look really, really old. But I actually really, really like it. So I don't know if you can see it, but the train is actually gold, like copper color. If I go too far away, there's not the camera's not going to catch it. So if you can see, you can't really see me too well over here. And you can probably still see the train a little bit. But... I'm going to go close up because that's where you all are. Oop, cleavage shot. Now I do feel like a real woman. So I really feel like I still have a little bit of a spooky going on, but I don't feel like I'm full on Cher needles this time, which is good. I kind of feel like almost like an Idina Menzel meets Cher kind of look. And um, I do these little white corners in my eyes, which I actually really like the way it's capturing it. And most of the products that I used were, um, I used e.l.f. brushes, which worked pretty, quite well, actually. So, great job, e.l.f. If you haven't tried the brushes, try them. Um, I already told you I'm a NYX girl. I love NYX Cosmetics from what I have of it. This black eyeshadow, which is great for the lining, much better than the cream paint was. Oh my gosh. It's a little messy, though, on the lids because I'm not too good at that yet, so we're just gonna sit far away when I blink. Um, the lashes, I think I'm going to try and put them on first next time because I still can't get them on right the first time like I want them to. But this way, there's not like caked on glue on my eyebrows and it's kind of a pretty color because I'm all about glitter. I'm hoping there's some still in my chest. If you can see, I want to shimmer a little bit. <laughs> but um, thank you so much for your support and I am really finally happy that I can say that I've gotten booked for my first public appearance as Melody on my own. So it's a holiday show and it's going to be in the city in Baltimore at Leon's on December 29th. So if you're around the area, please come out and support all the queens. I'm not sure who's in it quite yet, but they asked me if I would do it and I said yes, I would love to. So thank you so much for your support and I am very, very happy with how this is coming along. You know, I wasn't sure how the so it would all come together, but it came together really nicely, and now I'm definitely going to save time. Oop, something's on my lash. Definitely going to save time not having cake on glue. You know, I feel like I could do this in multiple colors, and eyebrow pencils actually work really good to color it, so it's kind of like a bluish purple, if you can see it underneath of it. It was originally. But anyway, thank you so, so much for any support you've given me. I am really happy with how I'm finally starting to look because I feel like I'm finally starting to get my own look, which is just huge for any baby dragon. You know, I'm still a baby dragon. I'm going to be a baby dragon for a while. But again, best of luck to anybody who wants to try drag. You know, it's, it's really fun and I feel like I've never been happier with myself just because I get to be myself, you know, and I love that. So, and who doesn't like dressing up? So come on now. So until next time, I really hope to see you at the show. Socks or boobies, but that's okay. Until you're in, you know, on stage and they sink down. And that's not something we want. So we're going to perk them up a little bit. Hey, there you go. Not bad, huh? Okay. Thank you guys. I'll see you soon.